In a world where everything seems to change so often, it's sometimes a joy to come across things that don't. However, some unchanging things still churn my tummy. Those back-to-school signs in the shops that appear just as the summer holiday begins are one of those things. We are at that moment in the year when the prophecy of those signs is borne out as students and staff return to school to learn. Everyone at schools and colleges and universities is a learner, teachers too. In this room, the Cathedral Song School, we will soon welcome new choristers and choral scholars to learn their trade as they begin to play a part in the musical life of this cathedral. It's a really exciting time in the year and for some it will be a slightly worrying time as they begin a new school or class, take up new subjects, move out from home or go to college and university. Over 900 years ago this cathedral was new. It was inhabited by a group of monks who lived by the community rule of St Benedict. He intended that each community would be a school, a place where monks would learn more about God and more about the love that God has for each of us, even when we think we're particularly unlovable. In this month, we welcome back our musical learners and we celebrate the dedication of this church. When we do that, we're reminded that each of us is asked to commit to learning more about God, about God's love, and about how we can share that and get to know God better. Each of you is daily in our prayers here, as we pray for the world, the church, and any who are in special need of prayer. Please do join us in prayer, in person or online, as we begin a new season of learning, that, as Richard of Chichester put it, we may know Christ more clearly, love him more dearly, and follow him more nearly, day by day. <laughs>